Zach was supported over 10 years ago by Buttle. I'm interested to know what the period in his life was like when Buttle intervened and what he thinks the help did for him both at the time and now that he's older. Um, as a young lad, I was eight and my mum died. Um, I was living in Liverpool and my dad was never around from when I was born. So were you able to get a chance to say goodbye to your mum? Were I was. I actually had a football match that day at school mm -hmm. and um, just before the game I was asked to go and see my mum but I didn't actually realise that would be the last time I would see her. Mm. Um, so, you know, I went, I just thought it was a normal visit and, you know, just as I was leaving, the family I was with said, maybe you should, you should kiss your mum before you leave. I didn't think anything of it. The next day I woke up and she sadly passed away. Yeah, that's a huge thing to take on at eight years old, isn't it? It is. It? It's only now sinking in from, mm. from, when, I was, from when I was eight because mm. you don't realise how, how big of a thing it is and mm. how much your life will actually change. At the time I was in, I'd say, probably a lonely place, you know, I was moving from here to there and I wasn't settled, I didn't have my friends around me, I was missing my mum. Mm -hmm. My head was all over the place, I, you know, I wasn't good to say the least, you know. Um, and, you know, I generally, at the time, didn't have a care in the world of what, what, what was happening. Do you think that your relationship with your auntie might have broken down? It would have, it was even, it was breaking down yeah. then. Yeah. It was breaking down then, I mean. She was trying her best for me, but I just wasn't wasn't taking it in. And so what would have been next? Could have been on the streets, could have ran away. I, I don't know. It just wouldn't have been a good place to be. So where did the bottle fit into all of that? Um, my auntie luckily found the Butter Trust, who actually could place me at a boarding school. Mm -hmm. um, at first, you know, I thought I was going to a regimented army school. I didn't want to go. I thought it was going to be the worst part of my life, but actually, it was the best time of my life at. What did it give you? It made me, it made me, you know, more aware of, of growing up, to say the least, and, you know, to put my head down and study, and, you know, the people that you're with, you're, they're actually not your friends, they're more of your family, because you're seeing these people 24-7. It was, it was a major part of my life that has really helped me. If you could look back on that time and see Zach the 13-year-old in lots of pain. What would you have wanted for him? I would have wanted exactly what's happened now. I wouldn't have changed an absolute thing. It's worked out really well, to be honest. Um, and if I hadn't have got the scholarship for the school, then that's what actually worries me. That really does worry me what I would have done because I definitely wasn't on the right road. You know, what the Bottle Trust have done for me, they've, in a, in a sense, they have saved my life. 